What's up, guys? It's BC. You're gonna hear an echo in this video because of the fact of, uh, I bought a massive, uh, alien claim wall sculpture from Hollywood Collectibles Group. This is number four. Fourth off the line of 125 made. Guys, okay. This came via FedEx. This thing weighs 100 pounds. It came on a pallet and I literally had to use a forklift to take it off. And I barely got it through my front door. So I'm actually recording in my living room. So, uh, this is going to be something crazy and massive. I know this was very expensive, guys. So for video, uh, or review number 171, we got Aliens, the Alien Queen Wall Sculpture exclusive version from Hollywood's Collectible Group, number 4 of 125. So I'm going to go ahead and get past this massive shipper. Um, if you guys want to take a look, like, this is crazy. Like, how huge this box is. So, let's go ahead and open it up and take a look at the artwork box. This is going to take me a bit, but let's do it. Let's check it out right now. Okay, guys, real quick, this is what I opened up to. Um, the peanut packing is real, baby. Um, but this thing is some kind of massive. It comes with instructions right here. Since it's wall mountable per the weight of the product, please insert your hanging nail into the wall as deep as possible. That's what she said. So, um... I'm going to show you guys something. So as I remove this part right here, I notice like the face of the alien. But this thing is so freaking heavy, guys. I'm going to take my time. I'm going to take this out and assemble it. It's going to be no time for you guys. So let's take a look at this massive freaking statue, boys. This is going to be crazy. Let's check it out right now. Uh, so I just took this, uh, you know, out of the box, which took forever. The peanut packing was unbelievable. Um, so here are some of the parts. Uh, these are just like add-ons that go with this. So uh, what I'm going to do, uh, let me show you guys this. And also over here as well, um, where we got past the peanut packing. And there is, you know, the main part of the sculpture. And down here, you guys will see like, you know, the floor from uh, the ship. You know, that was always really cool. I actually have a diorama specially made uh, just for that. Um, but it looks like some really cool pieces here. This thing's going to be unbelievable, guys. We look, and it's like 38 inches in width that's needed just to mount this. But I have a place to mount it, which you guys will see uh, in the video. There you guys see, like, the acid burn in the base with the Whalen yutani Corp um, uh, emblem right there, logo. But I love how they did the detail. I can already see from here, like, the acid burns. So, really cool. So, I'm going to go ahead and take these, take this, guys. I'm going to take it out of the packaging right here, show you guys the actual parts, and then we'll take a look at it actually mounted, wall mounted, for this Alien Queen sculpture. This guy, this is limited to 150 pieces, so this is a rare find. So, let me go ahead and, uh, I'm going to go ahead and take these guys. Let's take a look at all the parts right now, and then we'll mount it, mount it on, the, uh, on the wall, take a look at it there. But let's look at the parts right now. Okay, boys and girls, this is something crazy. Um, so I have this sitting in my like corner of my living room, like over here by where my dogs chill. And uh, this thing takes up a whole table. Um, it's unbelievable. Like the product details will be in the description of the video. Um, but this is gonna do it like zero justice. Uh, it's gonna be a lot better whenever you guys see it mounted. But, wow, is all I can say. Let's just check out a few of the details before we mount it. But I love this uh, pullback to open hatch lever right there. Um, there are some additions. These are the, um, uh, oh, let me get off of But right here we have the, uh, you know, coming out of the mouth. I can't think of the name of it. It's killing me right now. But the, uh, friggin' A. The alien, it's not the face hugger. Ah! But you guys know it, you know, it comes out of the mouth. It's just killing me right now because I'm a huge alien fan. I can't remember it. Um, and then it comes with two of these pieces, boys, which I believe are going to be... I have no idea what this is going to be, but it's going to be dope, whatever it is. Um, and there's two two of those. One, this is the, the larger piece, and so the other one is not, of course. Um, it's a little bit smaller, as you see there. Um, I'm just going to set this here, try not to damage anything. Um, but over here, we have the Wayland, you know, the acid burns in here, like I pointed out earlier that I've seen. Uh, there's one peg, which I believe, I don't know what's going to go there, but I'll figure out how this is all, uh, going to be assembled. Um, but I love this right here. Obviously, you know, this is going to go in this manner. I can kind of give you guys an idea of that. You know, that's going to be one option right there. But, alright guys, um, now I got some work to do. I'm going to go mount this on a wall. 
Um, and this is going to be in my man cave, so you know it will be a d totally different setting. I never record here, guys. So let's go ahead and take a look at this alien queen. God, man, this is crazy. And this was a pretty purchase, guys. This was not cheap. I love what I'm seeing so far with the paintwork. I mean, the lighting in here is horrible. So it's going to have a lot better justice whenever I bring it out uh, where we plan on uh, having this displayed. So long story short, I'm going to go assemble this, put, uh, hang it on the wall, mount it, uh, put all these extra pieces together. So no time for you guys. Uh, probably going to be a few hours for me. But let's go ahead and take a look at it right now, guys. Guys, I finally got this mounted on the wall. This thing is freaking sick. Look at this. Okay, I said review number like 107.28. Or 171. It's 172. Okay. This thing is freaking crazy, guys. Okay, um, as I move back, let me just give you guys an idea. Okay, here's a full Ikea Besta. And then there is the wall sculpture. The measurements are going to be in the in the uh, video description below, guys. So look down below if you're looking for the details. But overall, I mean, this thing is crazy. Um, Alien Queen wall sculpture, limited to 150. As you see there, guys, I love how they put attention to detail here with uh, the arms coming out from the sculpture right there. Uh, the lever, all the acid burns, level 5. I mean, this thing is just freaking nasty. And not to mention, I mean, if you plan on getting this, um, you're going to need a friend to help you. I know I did to get this mounted cause of the, simply because of the weight. Um, but overall, I mean, this is outstanding. I actually consider this one of the centerpieces of my Alien collection now. And let's just go over the details here. Um, now, there's two options for the, uh, what would, you know, usually call the chest burst or the little small Alien that comes out right here. You can go with a smaller piece right here they provide, they provide but... I just thought it looked a lot better with the longer piece coming out. Let me set that down. Okay. But, I mean, overall, they, I think they killed it right here, guys. They knocked it out of the park. Um, this isn't like uh, chloroboard. This is this is quality material here. Did you hear me knocking? It's not chloroboard. It's not some cheap kind of uh, paper board. So they put a lot of uh, manufacturing uh, production uh, paint work into this and I think they absolutely knocked it out of the park. So overall this is definitely freaking Exceeds a 10 of 10. This is like wow great um, And guys just a quick look. I mean how good they got it here. Um, you guys see like the tape here caution tape, you know, which is pretty popular with the uh, Alien products which I'll show you guys right here is where I have some of my alien stuff I have a few predator mixed in um, which I need to fix actually, but as you guys see back there, I had a diorama um, I had custom made which if you guys are ever looking for something like this like this is unbelievable This is a 92 inch in length diorama and there you see the bottom with the uh, caution tape the acid burns uh, I actually have a guy and he'll do it for anybody for a uh, you know for a small fee So if you guys ever interested in something like this feel free to hit me up in the comment sections I'm more than happy to help anybody but over here, guys, for review number 172, um, I don't know what else to say, but just, like, look at it, and wow. I mean, it speaks for itself. The paint job is out of this world. The, uh, I mean, the production and design is unbelievable how they did this. But the only thing is, like, you've got to mount it on a wall. There's no options. It's a definite wall sculpture uh, I tried actually setting it in there and it just it didn't look good. So wall mount it is So all right guys, it's pretty quick and to the point. I mean what you see is what you get So not to go to try to make this video too long. I'm gonna go ahead and stop right there I'll give it a, a close-up guys. So you guys can see the detail of the paint job right here. I Mean that is sick look at those teeth I mean, this is just dirty. Wow, I can't stand. And I actually added what I did, guys. I ordered some. I uh, I picked up these little L brackets just for extra support. I mean, we got a lot of money hanging on the wall here, and uh, one uh, screw that they provide. You know, and I actually use a little bit sturdier um, alternative uh, 
screw to have this uh, this mount on. And then I use these brackets just for extra support because uh, we got a lot of money hanging on the wall here and a piece of art. And I really don't want to walk in one day and see it face planted on the floor. So, alright guys, definite 10 out of 10 here. Back to back 10 to 10 reviews, which is what I like because uh, that has never happened before. Alright guys, uh, Alien Queen wall sculpture from Hollywood Collectibles Group. Uh, if you're able to get one and you're an Alien fan, trust me, you're going to love it, guys. But, you might, you know, it's going to hurt the bank account. I ain't going to lie. I mean, these things are expensive. But head on over to HCG, guys, if you're interested in this. See if they still have it. I bet you they do. Um, but overall, great statue. Great wall sculpture. Couldn't be more happy. So there it is, boys. Reno 172. Alien Queen wall sculpture. Hollywood Collectibles Group. Limited to 150. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget guys if you're new here don't forget to hit that like button drop a sub if you're new that way you can catch all the other videos I do this MLB the show video gaming uh, just random stuff that I enjoy doing so alright guys that's going to close it out don't forget after review number 200 I will be giving away a, uh, a piece from Sideshow Prime 1 uh, one of these companies 3-0 something like that DC I will give away every 100th review I do a giveaway uh, so look out for that I'll catch you guys on the next one, boys. Thanks for watching. Peace out.